For full disclosure, FNATR did send me this enclosure for free, but they are not sponsoring this video. In this video, I'm going to do three tests. I'm going to test with the door open, the door closed, and then the enclosure door is closed also. And we're going to see what the decibel reading looks like for all three of those conditions. The phone's 15 inches from the door of the printer and it's going to stay there for all three tests. The doors can clear it, so we're going to get a consistent distance from the printer on all three of these tests. I've decided to run a calibration for each one of these noise level tests. I just think that that's going to provide a very consistent offering of uh, different noises that are coming from the printer. It also gets very loud during the calibration, so I think that'll give us a good peak noise level. From left to right, we have the average decibel reading, the current decibel reading, and then the maximum decibel reading. I'm not going to play the entire test because they're 10 minutes long and I did three tests. That would make this video 30 minutes and really boring. I will play the mechanical sweep of the XY, which is the loudest portion of these videos, and then the results for each test. All right, that's test number one done. You have an average of 57.3 and a max of 70.2. I'll just confirm on the screen here. We'll reset all the data. And then start. I did mess up here by capturing the door closing as the maximum, so I do reset the maximum while it's running on this test. So that's test number two with the 3D printer door closed. We have an average of 50.2 and a max of 63.0. We're going to reset the stats. And then we're going to start it and close the enclosure doors. That's test number three done with the printer door closed and the enclosure doors closed. We have an average of 42.5 and a max of 56.9. So as a recap, with all the doors open, we have an average of 57.3 decibels and a max of 70.2. With the printer door closed, we have an average of 50.2. That's a 7.1 decibel reduction from the previous test. And then we have a max of 63. That's a 7.2 reduction from the previous test. So pretty standard across the board there. We got about seven decibels reduced by just closing the door. If we move on to the enclosure with those doors closed, we have an average of 42.5 and a max of 56.9. So the average dropped by 7.7 .7 decibels and the max dropped by 6.1. I still wouldn't want to sleep next to this thing in the enclosure or even do a full workday beside it, but it does seem to help to have this thing in an enclosure. We get a 7.7 .7 drop on the average and a 6.1 on the max. Whether that's worth the cost of an enclosure, I'll leave that up to you and I'll see you in the next one.